In today's episode, we're doing a little catch up from what's all been going on with me from this past week. So if you're interested in seeing what happened, you know what to do. Stick around. Well, hello everyone. I know I'm looking rough and I'm tired. My husband went to the hospital on Friday. His doctor sent him straight from his appointment to the ER. Uh, we found out that the infection that was supposed to have been cleared up two weeks ago, not. It was worse, and then the other leg had infection in it as well. It was starting. So they kept him. They did a procedure on him Saturday. They went in and operated on his legs, did some things on his legs Saturday. Uh, they had him up today walking a bit today. Today is Monday. They had him up walking around a little bit today to see how his pain level was. And so that's why I hadn't been uh, really doing any videos. And I'm not sure if I'm going to get the other two up this week that I had planned on. Now, I know the coffee station challenge from Kimberly Davis is already uploaded. I already had that done. So it'll be out on the 30th. But the um, the fall kitchen and the fall house tour, those will come after I get him home. I have one of them recorded, and then the other one I have to record. And then once I get that done and edited, I'll get them up, and I'll get them on as soon as possible. Uh, as you see, I'm exhausted today. So I slept late today. And I am going out to the hospital in about uh, an hour. I'll be out there to go stay with him to see what the doctors have to say today. Because he had dialysis, so and dialysis is in there for four full hours. So I was going to wait till he got a dialysis to go up and see him today. So as you see, there's not going to be any walking because I will be. Uh, I'll get up here at eight and try to beat the traffic and get to where he is at the hospital and sit with him until we find out when they're going to let him out. I don't think he's going to get out uh, today. I think it may be Wednesday, maybe Thursday before he comes home. Uh, we want to make sure that he has the right antibiotics this time and that everything is uh, functional, clean before we come home as far as his wounds are concerned. So I will keep you updated. Keep us in your prayer, and I hope I'll see you sometime this week. Bye-bye. If you want to see more, click the video here or the link below, and you'll be blessed.